You want to see me pull both triggers on this thing? Well, I'm crazy enough to try it. One, two, let's go. What's up everybody, my name is Scott and you're watching Kentucky Ballistics. We're back out of the range and today we are gonna have a lot of fun. I have a ridiculous gun to show you. So you've really enjoyed the elephant gun and I have too, but this is Kentucky Ballistics and we gotta step it up a notch. So I found something even more ridiculous than the elephant gun and that is this. This is a double barrel elephant gun chambered in 500 Nitro Express. So both of these barrels are rifled it's a break action. You slip your two rounds in right there, close that up, and you got two triggers. Now, you can pull both triggers at the same time if you want on this thing. So today may get a little bit interesting. I'm really excited to try this thing out. I have not shot it yet. So first, I wanna show you what this thing shoots, and then we're gonna go get started. So here's some ammo that you're familiar with. This is 5.56, this is 7.62 by 39, 308, 4570, 30-06. This is what we've been using in our elephant gun. This is 458 lot with a 500 grain projectile. And this is the 500 Nitro Express. And that is a 570 grain projectile. All right, as usual, we're gonna start out with some steel targets. The ammo I'm gonna be using is Federal A-frame 570 grain rounds. But before we blast these steel targets, I wanna say thank you to Big Daddy Unlimited for sponsoring today's video. If you're busy like me and you don't have time to look for all the good deals, you need to check out Big Daddy Unlimited. They do all the work for you and you reap all the benefits. All you do is pay a simple membership every month. They got a really cool thing going, so be sure and check them out. And again, a big thank you to Big Daddy Unlimited for sponsoring today's video. All right. <laughs> One round. Woo! And two rounds. They say you should pull your back trigger first. That way you don't accidentally pull both triggers at the same time. Oh. All right, target on the right. This thing really thumps. Oh. Oh, still knocked it over. <laughs> Woo! Oh, oh shoot right out of there, that was awesome. I'm gonna go set them up and do it one more time. I can't resist. All right, let's do that again. That, that's a lot of fun. Boop. Let's hit them again. We're gonna do the one on the left again. Let's reach back here and grab this bat trigger. <laughs> oh. Okay, now the one on the right. Here we go. <laughs> Got a pretty good dent right there and a pretty good dent right there. Oh yeah. <laughs> I've got some new steel targets I've been meaning to bring out here, but uh, just haven't put them together yet. You guys have been requesting sweatshirts, so I finally got sweatshirts. You can check them out at KentuckyBallistics.com. All right, I've been meaning to shoot this toilet for quite a while, so I got it set up, but I think we need to put some nacho cheese in it. Yep, yeah. let's close the top on that. Not really sure which trigger goes to which barrel. We're about to find out. Oh! Ha <laughs> ha! 
That's what happens anytime I eat Taco Bell. Oh my gosh. This is awful. Oh. All right, the nacho cheese was pretty eventful, as expected. But now, let's shoot some gravy. I don't know if I mentioned this in the beginning, but uh, this ammo is really, really expensive. I'm gonna let you guess. Guess how much 20 rounds of 500 Nitro Express costs? $265. Oh, whoa! Oh my gosh. Hit <laughs> that next one. Oh no. No! Wow. That's all I can say is wow. Wonder if I can catch these when they shoot up in the air. Oh, I got one. It smells awful right now. Like it vaporized that gravy and I'm inhaling it like a humidifier. Guess what time it is? It's the the elephant gun before was good at vaporizing watermelons but uh i think this one takes the cake so now i have a five gallon water jug but uh i'm gonna add a little bit of something to it cut the top almost all the way off of this five gallon water jug and i'm gonna put six pounds of nacho cheese in it no oh. it'll fit come on there we go. <laughs> this should be interesting. Here we go. Does cheese and water mix? We are about to find out. Broke our table. <laughs> that was a lot of force to snap that thing. I mean, it did have some holes in it, but uh, still, that's pretty ridiculous. All right, I know what you've been waiting for. You wanna see me pull both triggers on this thing. Well, I'm crazy enough to try it. We're gonna do it. I'm not gonna try to hit anything. I'm just gonna aim at the berm and hold on for dear life. All right, I'm gonna do this in real time so you guys don't say I'm faking it. There's one round, and here's two rounds. Locking it, safety's off. Let's get a good stance here, that second camera can see me. There was only one. Okay, I chewed up my hand a little bit. We're gonna try one more time. One. Two. All right, let's go. Whoa! Wow! Whoa! Wow! Oh, 
Real quick before you leave this video, I gotta tell you I'm doing a 1 million subscriber giveaway. I know we're over a million, but I still wanna do my 1 million subscriber giveaway. Giving away a lot of cool stuff. It costs you nothing to enter. Just click the link in the description down below. So, hands down, this is my new favorite gun. What did you think about the double barrel 500 Nitro and what else do you wanna see me do with it? Leave your answers in the comment section down below. If you enjoyed today's video, do me a favor and give it a like. And if you're not subscribed to Kentucky Ballistics, do yourself a favor and hit that subscribe button. Also be sure and check me out on Patreon, Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, and be sure to check out Kentucky Ballistics Clothing. Links to all those can be found in the description down below or on my website, KentuckyBallistics.com. Again, my name is Scott. Thank you so much for watching Kentucky Ballistics, and I'll see you next time.